Hai, apa khabar? How are you? Khabar baik. Khabar Terima baik. Sama-sama. <laughs> <laughs> Very good, eh? You try to practice? Wow. Yes. Okay. Hmm. Where is others eh? Who did not attend our class for today? Just now, I just have... Oh, forget it. Uh, please write down your name and your metric number in chat box. Because I want to check your attendance. Mao Yu, are you here? Mao Yu, okay, good. Gao Maman, Maman. Where's Maman? Maman, are you there? I, didn't, I can't find you in my screen. Your name is not here, Marman. Okay, maybe it's Marman is not here. Bangdi, Bangdi is here. Chang Yu, okay, Chang Yu is here. Here. Wen Wen, Wen Wen is. Wen Wen, where are? Asia. Okay, Wen Wen is Asia. here. Okay, okay. Yun Tao, Ma Yun Tao. Hmm, where is I? Yeah, I'm here. Ah, yeah, yeah. I see you. Okay, Yun Tao. Jing Xuan, Jing Xuan. Hey, Jing Xuan. Yeah, I see you. All right. Uh, Yu Xuan. Yu Xuan. Where are yes. You? Okay, Yu Xuan. Li Wan. Okay, here. Okay, Li Wan is here. Hello. Okay. Sunna. Sunna is not here. Oh, Sunna. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Chu Yang, Chu Yang. Wei Xu Yang. Okay, Wei Xu Yang is. Okay, hi. 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 Ting Bing. Deng Ting Bing. Okay, Deng Ting Bing is here also. Yu Ming. Yu Ming. Hello. Hi, hello. Ying Ming. Aku ada kelas ke? Saya booking ke sini dulu. Aku tak keluar ke sana. <laughs> Yu Ming. Where are you, Yuming? Yuming is not here. Uh, Yuhan. Ah, mana Yuhan? Tak nampak pun. Huang, eh, Chen Yuhan. Chen Yuhan. Are you there? He's not here. Chiang Wen. Chiang Wen Rui. Chang Wing Liu. Okay. Chen Yu Han. Chen Yu Han is not here. Okay. Huang Yu Ming is already. Chen Yu Hang is not here. Chen Yu Hang, are you there? Uh, Chen Yu Hang said. Uh... There is uh, something wrong with uh, her internet. Oh. Uh, if she will be here. Okay, okay, okay. So waiting for... Uh, just uh, just a few moments. Okay. Gaoman Man is already... All right. Okay, are you calling me just now? Uh, Huang Yu Ming. Yes. I calling you. I just entered the class. <laughs> okay, see you later. Okay, because in this class, we just have a 15 people, so I have to memorize your name, okay? But please don't make, uh, make please don't, jangan marah, eh? Because sometimes my pronunciation to read your name are in Chinese, 
Chinese uh, word is, is my, my, my ring is not good lah if I try to read in the Chinese, good, the Chinese name. Okay, don't worry eh. I try. Mao yeah. Yu, Gao Man Man, Chu Bang Di, Pu Chiang Yu, Zhang Wen Wen, Ma Yun Tao, He Jing Xuan, Lao Yu Xuan, Li Wan. Uh, Sun Na, Wei Chu Yang, Deng Qing Bing, Wang Yu Ming, Chen Yu Hang, and Chang Wen Ri. Okay. Is it okay? I try to read your name in Chinese. <laughs> Okay. Doctor, yes, Where is it? I have a question. That uh, la last Friday you sharing the post and two information in the group. Is that assignment or just an event? It's not in group the course coursework. It's just event lah, just activity. It's not mandatory. Ah, okay. ah, not okay. mandatory, just selective. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh, it just to invite you to involve the activity only. Okay, try mm -hmm. lah, try lah. You can tell. Doctor, doctor, we have five subjects this semester, not group the Malay language. <laughs> Alah, simple je. Try make it a simple poster je. You, you can use the Canva apps. Okay, you can use Olay your iPhone. La, if, if, we, if we got, got time. Ah. Yeah, to get the experience kan. Ah. So you open some of application from the your, your phone and then you create a a simple poster, you know, the last time, just a five student uh, joined this, this activity. So the whole of student got, got the prize. The whole of student got the, what we call it? The certificate. Just five only. Okay, if you're not number uh, one, number two, number three, number four, number five, you can which one. Why? It, it is not a personal certificate. It's about the group. No, no, no. Personal certificate, like I mean, okay. It is a oh. person effect. So I mean, it's just five candidates only join about the poster. Oh. Oh. When when I asking the student, why you did not join? I said, no lah, teacher, I'm busy lah, teacher. And no lah, teacher, I'm worried yes, lah, teacher. Because few of them, they are working and, and then they got the assignment, you, you know. Allah, you take the 30 minutes only to create with your phone. Okay. Boleh lah, okay. eh? Okay. <laughs> Please lah join, please lah join. Please, please, please. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, for those who love a sing, okay, I know in this class, we have a two uh, students, they are take from music class. So please join sing a song competition, yeah? Just a simple, simple singing only, all right? Uh, to get the experience. Okay, so let's begin our class for today. Uh, is it I, I should say selamat pagi? No. Is it selamat tengah hari? Selamat tengah hari or selamat petang? Should I say as a greeting? Guys? As a greeting, should I say selamat pagi, selamat petang or selamat tengah hari? Based on occurring time. Selamat, Selamat tengah hari. hari. Tengah hari. So now it's 2 p.m. already. Selamat what? Why? <laughs> now it's 2 p.m. already. Actually, tengah hari is... Uh, tengah hari. No. Tengah hari we start 12 p.m. until 12 until 59. So now it's 2 p.m. So 2 p.m. is what the best grading? Selamat malam. No lah. <laughs> Selamat malam. We finished the class already. Selamat, Selamat petang. petang. Yes. Yeah. Selamat petang. Okay. Selamat petang. Alright. So Selamat petang semua. So you should reply. Selamat petang. Okay. Alright. So class, let's begin our class today. Okay, I want to uh, teach you about lesson three, about your family and your friends. Okay, and then I want to share with you about your assignment. Okay, I already has been post in Putra Blast. All right. Uh, one more about your test next week. Eh, no, 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 no. You the, the next, next week. Yeah, your test is not next week. Your test is on December. Okay, so just relax only. 
the gas. Okay. Let's, the, yeah. the PB, PB system, we, we, we still cannot find down the discharge. What happened? Uh? I, I'm not, I don't understand about the system. Uh, yeah, uh, because because we are the MBA, right? Master, and then we, we have the, uh, they say, that time I asked Miss Akita, I say MBA got the, uh, in, uh, the, uh, the system is the separate with the other uh, other subject uh, other courses and then and then we will in the MBA and then we, we, we just only see our courses but without yeah. using Malay language yeah so you know you, you say you up upload the slide or any information to the PP we, we cannot download we cannot see that I do I do okay lah okay lah I share in uh group lah after this uh whatsapp lah most of the slide and then the assignments okay lah like okay lah whatsapp lah whatsapp lah okay, <laughs> okay. thank you for your information eh? if not i did not about the problem okay all right hmm. so if i forget please remind me yeah because yeah lah i'm is going to old now okay so forgetting no, is my you, problem you, you, you still 18 ma <laughs> 18? oh my god 18. <laughs> okay so let's begin our class topic. Okay, topic three: Pengenalan keluarga dan sahabat, introduction to family and friends. Okay, so what we we will uh, learn for this lesson is at the end of the lesson, you know how to introduce yourself. Okay, and also how to describe about your friend to us. Ah, I I believe everybody you have a best friend, right? So you can choose which one from your friend because you have. Try to imagine your friend, try to describe your friend, and introduce your friend to us, right? In Bahasa Melayu. Ah. All right, so first of all, we're going to, uh, we are talking about my family first. So how to talking about family? First of all, we have to know about the name of the family's members, okay? It's not about their names, but the, the general name of family's members, where like fathers, mothers, Sisters, younger sisters, and brothers. What we call it, they are in Bahasa Melayu. Okay, sister, kakak. Okay, kakak. Some of students, they always say kaka only. It's not kaka. Kaka. You have to put a K and the end of the word kaka. Okay, sister. And then for the fathers, okay. Uh, huh? Ah, tak apa, tak apa, Okay, sorry lah kalau bising eh. Okay, so for father, we have to call ayah or bapa. Okay, this is the same method like uh, English. Some of them, they are called father. Sometimes they are called daddy, dad. Okay, so same also uh, in Bahasa Melayu. You can call they are ayah or bapa. So that's me refer to father. Okay, continue. Mothers. Okay, mother. Maybe you can call, uh, they are as a ibu or a ma. Sometimes ma. Okay. Uh, ibu, a ma or ma. A. Is it hippopet or itali? A ma. Hippopet or itali? Son of a ma. Who know? E, son of E for E. Hippopet or Itali? Hippopet. Yes, Hippopet. Again, Emma. Is it? Hippopet, uh, Emma. All right, continue. Younger sister. Okay. Uh, we call it Adik. Adik. Okay, for uh, Malay language, actually, we did, we did not specify the gender. Okay. But you can refer about the people, you can refer also about the future. Okay, so now, if you refer the future, it's the little girl, right? So you can put adik perempuan or adik. Okay, both of that is correct. Okay, younger sister. That means it's the, the little one is younger than you lah. Okay, so the last one is brother. We call it abang. Abang. Okay. Ah, this is a very easy. So, may I have uh, Bangdi? 
Bang D, where are you? Yes, madam, I'm here. Okay, try to read again for us. Uh, uh, sister is Kaka. Yeah, very good. Uh, father is uh, Aya and uh, Papa. Okay, not Aya, Aya. Aya, Aya. Ah. And then the mother is uh, Ibu. Uh, Ibu. Mm -hmm. Uh, 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 ma. Mm -hmm. uh, ma. Okay. Uh, your younger sister is uh, uh, Adik. Adik. Okay, the last Adik. one. Uh, brother is uh, uh, Abang. Abang. Ooh, very good, uh, Abang Lee. Your pronunciation uh, is very clear. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right, so let's move to the next slide because Abang Lee is a very clever today. So I just pre uh, present to you a very short essay. Ah, okay. So look at guys. Wait, yeah. Tak apa lah. Okay, wait, yeah. Wait a moment. <laughs> Kenapa <laughs> ada Okay, okay, class. <clears throat> Alright, so this is the short essay. How to uh, present about your family to us. Alright, so listen carefully. I have to read uh, first and then you have to practice behind your mic. Okay, listen carefully, guys. Hi, semua. I just put the symbol because to help you. Uh, too easy pronoun, yeah? Because I have... Uh, three syllable. Actually, if I try to delete this symbol, oh, what happened? If I try to delete this symbol, okay, some of students they are confused. They always say semu, semu. Actually, this is not semu, semua. Okay, mua is a diphthong. You know what a diphthong is? Okay, you know what a diphthong, right? So, hi, semua. Okay, nama saya Alina. Ini keluarga saya. I repeat again. Keluarga. Keluarga. Okay. Ah, uh, for Chinese students, they have pro problem with the mother tongue, so they have problem to pronounce the letter R. Keluarga. Saya. Nama ayah saya Ahmad. Nama ayah saya Ahmad. Okay, last class, the sum of student, they say, nama saya, nama ayah saya Ahmada. Is it not Ahmada? Did you find the letter A after D? Not right. So, Ahmad only, not Ahmada. Dia seorang jurutera. Nama ibu saya pula, Arina. Ha, please, they don't confuse about Alina and Arina. Alina is her daughter. Alina is her mother. Alright. Dia seorang suri rumah. Suri rumah. Okay. Second. Okay. So before we go into the second paragraph, I want to listen uh, from Manman. Manman, please help me to read about the first paragraph. The first, the first paragraph or second paragraph? First. First, right? Okay. Mm. Hi, semua. Mm -hmm. nama, nama saya Alina. Mm -hmm. I keluarga saya. Keluarga saya. Keluarga saya. Nama ayah saya uh, Amun. Amun. 
ะฮามาไม่เอออามาดีอาซาซาซาวงจูเทอร์จูรูเทอร์ what a funny man man it's interesting I think yeah จูรูเทอร์จูเทอร์นามาอิบุสายาพูลาอารีนาดิอาสโลนสลีรูมาบายกูดิอาสโอรังสุรีรูมาโอเคทีมกัสเซ่มันมันโอเค so what the meaning for this sentence I try to translate sentence out in this sentence in this paragraph I try to, tra to translate sentence by sentence, yeah. Okay, listen carefully. Hi, semua. Okay. Hi, everybody. Hi, everyone. This is a great thing first. Nama saya Alina. My name is... Who is it? Alina. Okay. Ini keluarga saya. This is my family. Nama ayah saya Ahmad. My father's name is Ahmad. Dia seorang jurutera. Okay. What does it mean by jurutera? Guys. What does it mean by jurutera? What is it? Jurutera. Ah. Jurutera. 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 What is the meaning of jurutera? He, pardon, sorry. Uh, is it a country? Country, not country. Jurutera, Ahmad Jobs, Ahmad Fashion. What is it? Uh, engineer. Yes. Okay. <laughs> He is an engineer. All right. Jurutera. Nama ibu saya pula Arina. My father's name is Arina. Dia seorang suri suri rumah. Okay, how about suri rumah? What does it mean by suri rumah? Hmm. What is it suri rumah? I'm waiting for your answer. Housewife. Yes, housewife. Okay, okay. So guys, look at dia. Okay, dia. Okay. If you uh, if you learn from uh Bahasa Inggris, English language, he for man, she for woman, right? Okay. For Bahasa Melayu, we did not specify the gender. So so you can use dia for boys and dia also for girl. All right. Uh, look at dia seorang jurutera. Now, dia is refer for Ahmad. Ahmad is Alina's father. And the next one, dia is refer for Arina. Arina is Alina's mother. Alright? So, I understand? Everybody clear about the first paragraph? Alright, so if you clear, so we're going to the next paragraph. Saya ada tiga orang adik beradik. Alright, alright. Saya ada tiga orang adik beradik. Nama abang saya Azman. Dia suka membaca buku. Okay, look at guys. I already put the red color because almost uh, almost people always read with the pronouns membaka. It's not ka. Son of C is C. Membaca buku. Okay. Nama adik Perempuan saya pula Amira. Dia suka bermain dengan anak patung. Saya sayang keluarga saya. Okay. So the meaning is, saya ada tiga orang adik-beradik. Is I have three of sibling. Okay. When you say sibling, is it conclude you or not? Adik-beradik. Concludes you or not? Guys. Huh? 
For sure, the answer is yes. Okay, conclude. Tiga. Tiga is three. Satu, dua, tiga. So, look at the future. One, two, three. Okay. Tiga orang adik beradik. But if you say, I have one brother and one sister. So, is it conclude you or not? The answer is no. Okay. No. Uh, yes, the answer is no. Very good. Okay. So, if you say adik beradik, that's when conclude you. Nama abang saya Azman. My brother's name is Azman. Dia suka membaca buku. He love to read books. Alright. Nama adik perempuan saya pula Amira. Adik perempuan is youngest sister. My younger sister name is Amira. Dia suka bermain dengan anak patung. She love to play with a doll. Alright. Saya sayang keluarga saya. I love you. <laughs> no lah. I love my family. Okay. I love my family. Alright. Okay. So I hope you understand about this paragraph. Okay. Because in this paragraph bring you to answer a sum of question. Look at guys. Oh, I already put the answer. Wait here. I have to delete first. Oh my god. Wait here. Ini hilang lagi. Okay, class, look at. Okay, so uh, from the paragraph, okay, it's bring you to answer a few of question. Look at the question number one. Siapakah nama ayah Alina? Okay, right. So, so what the meaning of siapakah? Siapakah is who? Okay. I put the meaning in the bracket. Who? Okay. Ayah Alina. What the meaning of ayah, guys? Ayah is what? Tell me the answer. Yes, father. Father for who? Alina, right? So, who is Alina's father's name? Right? Siapakah is who? Who is Alina's father's name? Okay. The second question is apakah? Apakah? What the meaning of apakah? Apakah is what? Okay. So what? Apakah pekerjaan bapa Alina? Okay. Who know? What the meaning uh, for this question? Job? Yes, pekerjaan is job. Job for whose? Uh, her, her father. Her father. Her father. Her father. Alina's who? father. Yes, Alina's father. Okay. What is Alina's father's job? All right. What is Alina's father's job? All right. Very good. So the next question, same like the first question, you just change about the ayah to. Ibu Alina. That's me. Is Alina's mother's name. All right. This question number four. Alina ada berapa orang adik beradik? Okay. How many? Okay. Berapa is how? Okay. How many sibling does Alina have? Adik beradik is sibling. How many sibling does Alina have? Okay. So the last question is. Apakah hobi adik Alina? Hobi for whose? Alina. Are you sure Alina? Hobi for whose? Alina's younger sister. Yes, Alina's younger sister. So what Alina's younger sister hobby? So guys, I put uh, the previous slide. Okay. 
So please find the answer based on the, this text. All right. So I give you a three minute. Okay. So I will call your name one by one. So you have to uh, read your answer. Okay. All right. Okay, done. Guys, you got the answer already? All right, so I have to read your name. Please give your answer with a full of sentence. Okay? Uh, that's just the answer only, but you have to read with a full of sentence. Okay, so can we start with the first question? Is siapakah nama ayah Alina? So, may I have Pu Chiang Yu? Pu Chiang Yu. Uh, hello, doctor. Yes, hello. Uh, uh, I, think, uh, I think her father's name is uh, uh, Aman, Amand. Amanda. <laughs> Ahmad. No, Ahmad. Ah. Ahmad, okay. What do you answer in Bahasa Melayu? Uh, Aman, Amand. Yeah, Ahmad is Ahmad. The only Ahmad, is it? The only Ahmad. Can you give me with a full of sentence? What is uh, your name? My name is Ahmad. What is Alina's father's name? Alina's father's name is Ahmad. So what Alina's father's name in is Ahmad in Bahasa Melayu? Uh, Lama ayah saya Ahmad. Okay. Oh, 
Nama witnya. Okay. Nama ayah saya Ahmad. Ahmad. Uh, ah, yeah. ya. Okay, second. Is it this is your answer? Uh, uh, <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Uh, this is okay. my answer. Okay, yeah, okay. So, guys, do you have a uh, different answer? Puchan, uh, uh, you have the different answer? Others? Or your answer is same like Puchan, you? Same. Same. Or different? Guys, is it I talk alone? Uh, same. Same. Okay, if your answer is same, okay. Let's I correct I try to correct your answer, guys. Okay, yes, actually I uh, Alina's father's name is Ahmad. But if you want to write down the answer at least, so saya look at nama ayah saya Ahmad. What's uh does it mean by Ahmad? Eh, Ahmad saya. Nama ayah Alina Ah. Man. Yes, Liwan, very good. You should put Alina, not Saya. Okay, because the question asking about Alina's father's name, not your father's name. Okay, if you put okay. Saya, that means it's your father's name is Ahmad lah. Okay, you have to put nama Ayah Alina Ahmad. Or maybe you can put nama Ayah Dia. Ahmad. Okay. Dia is refer for whose? Dia is refer for Alina. Okay. Ah, Dia is refer for Alina. Nama ayah dia Ahmad. Or nama ayah Alina Ahmad. Okay. So to be a grammatical center, please put ialah. Actually is ialah is sometimes it look like is. Okay. Nama ayah Alina ialah Ahmad. Or nama ayah dia Ahmad. Okay. Alright. So settle by question number one. Thank you for guys answer. Who can you? Alright. So we go to the next question is uh, Zhang Wenwen. Zhang Wenwen, are you there? Uh, I'm here. Okay, what the answer for question number two? Uh, Alina's papa is uh, Aman, Amanda. Aman? Now you're going to the second uh, to, question. To Amanda, uh? Amanda, sorry, Amanda, Amanda is uh, Jura Tara. Ahmad is a Jurutera. Okay, please answer in Bahasa Melayu. Uh, the Alina, Alina, Papa, Saya, Jurutera. Alina, Papa, Saya, Jurutera. Okay, I just write down your answer eh. Alina, Papa, Saya, Jurutera. Okay. It looks like you try to translate by, word by word. You write down the words, the answer in English, and then you translate word by word in Bahasa Melayu. That's why your structures uh, seem like in English. Okay, so guys, the structures, the sentence in English and Malay language are very different. Okay, Alina, Bapa, Saya, Jutera. Actually, the structure in Bahasa Melayu, okay, Ayah or bapa Alina. Eh. Ayah or bapa Alina. Seorang. Jurutera. So. Or dia. Seorang. Jurutera. Jurutera. Okay. Ah. Okay. Ah. This is the incorrect answer. Alright. Terima kasih. Uh, Ma Yun Tao. Uh, <clears throat> okay. Uh, 
Nama Nama Ibu Alina mm, Ila uh, Arena Arena Okay, correct answer Arena. Yes, complete Nama Ibu Alina ialah Arena Okay, settle So, uh, question number four uh, Bang Di, Chiu Bang Di Bang Di? Yes, madam. Yes, answer number four. Uh, who is uh, Tiga? Uh, uh, should, should I say the complete sentence? Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 <laughs> I can't find the sentence. You have to find from the question. Uh, Alina uh, ada. Al Alina ada. Uh, How? Uh, a rock. How? Uh, ba ba tiga. No, ber berapa? Berapa is the question. Ber so no need to put lah. Alina ada. Tiga. How? Tiga. Tiga. Tiga what? Tiga pieces. Uh, uh, raw, adik, um, baradik. Yes. Okay. Alina ada tiga orang adik beradik. Settle. Okay. So, terima kasih. Uh, Sama -sama. Continue. Um, Jing Xuan. Her Jing Xuan. Yes, madam. Answer number five. I'm still trying looking for a hobby. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hobby you know, for Adi Alina. Adi Alina. Mm. So, uh, the. What is it? Can I say, can I say the name? <laughs> <laughs> The names because I what is it? Yeah. Uh Nama Adik Purampua Saya Pula Amira. No, they are not asking about the names. They're asking about the hobby. Mm. Uh, they're asking what's uh Alina's younger sister hobby? So your answer is yeah. Her name is Amira. Is it? That the answer? Yes. No. Um, Amira. No. Not the question's answer. But no. I'm, I I don't know what's her hobby. <laughs> Adoy. <laughs> Jin Shuan. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Mate, please help your friend. What the answer is? Hmm. Who want to answer the last question? Membaca buku. Are you sure membaca buku is Alina's younger sister hobby? I uh, was thinking membaca buku is Alina's brother's hobby. Anak patung. Anak patung. What happened with anak patung? Anak patung is a doll. What happens with the... anak patung? Tiket. Ah, dengan, dengan is which? What happened with the anak patung? Suka bermain. Yes. Suka bermain dengan anak patung. Okay. Ah, you can use adik Alina or dia. Which one lah? Okay. Ah, hobi adik Alina. Or dia, uh, so which one? Suka bermain dengan anak patung. Okay. Okay, class. Is it clear about this part? Class, I talk to with all of you. Is it clear? Or you have still a confused? Are you, you don't know how to find the answer? 
Hey, madam. Yes. Sorry, madam. May I call the hobby of Atik Alina in yes. English? Play with a dog. Okay. 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 All right, guys. If you don't know how to find the answer, I tell you again. Please find the keyword from the question and look at back at the text. You will be find the answer. Okay. So, guys, I want to inform you they are a very important in your test, in your first assessment. Okay. You will be end oral test for your test one lah, uh, at uh, December 7, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. So, you will be an oral test. So, for the second question, you will read the text like this one. Okay. For a reading, for me, it's okay lah. Because everybody, you can teach with a good pronunciation. But from the text, for question number three, you have to answer a few of questions. Find the answer from the text. Right? So how to find the answer? Please find the keyword. You will be find the answer. Okay? We are talk Now I'm talking about your test one. All right. So settle. So class, is it clear about my family? Any question? Ada soalan? Ada soalan, guys? Tiada. Tiada. Very good. Okay, so let's move to the next slide where we have to talking about your good friend. Okay? Sahabat baik saya. My good friend. Some of you call best friend. Okay. So it's up to you lah. Alright. So I just put a sum of a picture guys. Sorry. I just take the, the guys uh, picture from the Google. Actually I don't know who that guys. If you know this guys. Please say hello for her. Okay. So let's read our text. The second text. Hi semua. Actually this is a greeting. Hi semua. Ini sahabat baik saya. This is my best friend. Okay, ini sahabat baik saya. This is my best friend. Good friend. Nama dia Ravi. Okay, his name is Ravi. Dia sangat tinggi. That means is, he is very tall. Tinggi. Kulit dia gelap. His skin is dark. Gelap is dark. Rambut dia pendek. His hair is... Is it long or short? Short. Short. His hair is short, pendek. Dia kurus. Okay, thin. Or slim. She is thin or slim. Dia sangat tampan. She is very handsome. Okay, not just handsome only because you find the word sangat. So you should be say very. Dia sangat tampan. Dia sangat ceria. He is very cheerful. Okay. He is a very cheerful. Okay. Look at guys. When we are talking about the friends, okay, what we have to do is uh, we try to describe about your best friend. So that's why I told you, you have a many friend. So now you have to describe about your friend to us. Okay. So that's why uh, you can tell me about the height of your friend, the color of his skin. Okay. And also the length of their head, uh, the physical shape, the physical appearance, and also about their character. Okay. So, guys, I give you a five minute only. Okay, five minute only. What you have to do is what we are going to do. I want to try to write down a short paragraph, paragraph like this one. And you are talking about your friends. Okay, uh, so dia sangat tinggi. What, what does it mean by tinggi? If your friend is short, fine. The meaning of short in Bahasa Melayu. How about skin? Kulit dia dark or bright? 
If bright, what the meaning bright in Bahasa Melayu? Okay. Rambut dia pendek. How about their hair? Is it their hair is long? Is it their hair is curly? Fine. The meanings uh, long or curly are in Bahasa Melayu also. And how about their body shapes? Is it their thinny or fat or slim or whatever? Fine. The words are in Bahasa Melayu also. Dia sangat tampan. Is it she is ugly or beautiful? Uh, or what? Fine. The words are in Bahasa Melayu and also about the character. Dia sangat. What is it about the character? It's funny. So what funny are in Bahasa Melayu? So you can use this, uh, this script, okay? And try to replicate about your friend. Okay, guys. I give you around 10 minutes. Five to ten minutes on it, and then I will come back. So I just uh call a few of us name, and you have to read about your friend to us. Okay, guys. Clear. All right. So it's clear. It is a very good. So you can start now. I will come back at three uh five p.m. Okay, three and not three lah. Around that lah. Around three five. 3 or 2, 3, 5 p.m. Okay? So, let's do it your part.
Okay, guys. Okay, I hope have you done it. So that's me call your name. And you have to read about your friends. Yes, okay. So may I have who? Hmm, who did not done, yeah? Um Lau Lau Yushuan. Lau yes. Yushuan, yes. Hmm. Hi Samua. Ini sahab sahabat baik saya. Hmm? Nama dia menu. Dia sangat tinggi. Tinggi, not tinggi. 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 Mm -hmm. Tinggi. Right? Kulit dia gelap. Rambut dia panjang. Dia kurus. Dia sangat tempan. Dia sangat Sharia. <laughs> Why? Why your script same like me totally? <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's not fair. <laughs> okay, I just want to know your friend is younger boys. Um, ah, you sure? Uh, you sure? Yeah. Your, your friend is girl or boy? Uh, it's a girl. Okay, so if your friend is girl, you did not say tampan. Because tampan is just for boys only. Oh, I got it. Okay, so I will teach you what the best word for a girl if you want to describe she is a very good looking. Okay, so after this, eh, follow my class on the, 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 next, the next slide. Okay, wait now, which one? So let's me... Um, continue with the next person, Lee Wan. Your turn, Lee Wan. Hello, madam. Yes. Um, it's uh, about your friends. Okay. Hi, Samna. Samwa. Ini sepak sahabat baik saya. Nama dia Frank. Dia sangat um, sangat tidak tinggi. 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 Alright, continue. Um, ku dia um, uh, sorry. Uh, ku dia um, not <laughs> Glab. <laughs> Glab. Same also. Okay. Glab. Continue again. Um, uh, Rampat dia pendek. Hi, same also. Okay. Continue. <laughs> okay. Dia continue. Cruz. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, dia sangat uh, cantik. Okay, chante, all right. Chante. Dia second chen chenria. Almost same, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to say other words. You just change your you just change your name of your friend and then you just name but the uh characteristic. Okay. So is it your your friend is girl? Uh, uh, no, a boy. Yes, boy. Okay. Yushuan, uh, her friend is girl, but they put tampan. But your friend is boy, you put chante. So, it's, you have to twist each others, right? So, I tell okay. you, if your friend is girl, so you put chante, not tampan. If your friend is boy, you have to put tampan, not chante. You got something? But. Okay, very good. So the last thing, okay, from from the last one, may I have a sunna? Come on, sunna. Hi. Okay. Hi. Uh, I'm here. Yes. 
Um, can you hear me? Yes, yes, yes. Go ahead. I hear you. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, hi, Sama. Ini sahabat baik saya. Mm -hmm. Nama Daya Sunny. Mm -hmm. Dina Ti. Dot Nina, Dia. Dia. Today, mm -hmm. Tinji. Yeah, tidak tinggi, alright. Tidak tinggi, yeah. Uh, kuni daya gip, gelap. 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 Okay. Remba dina pajang. Pajang. Pajang, okay. Pajang, yeah. Dina kurus. Hmm? Kurus. Kurus. Okay, continue. Dina Saga Chanti. Chanti. Dina Saga Como. It means cute. Cute. Chomel. 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 <laughs> Chomel. Okay, so now very good. Uh, so many vocabs to try to change from this uh, paragraph. Okay, so let me Thank correct you. your pronunciation for with dia. Okay, this is dia. not dina, eh? not dina. Dia. 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 Yes. Dia. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank okay. You. Thank you to all of you. Okay, so let's continue. Okay, so now I want to teach you about the vocabulary and this vocabulary to help you to describe about your friend's character. Okay, so let's be looking for the first. Uh, we're talking about their hair first. Okay, look at for your friend. Is it your friend? She have a long hair or short hair? If she, she or he have a long hair, so you should say rambut panjang. But if she have a short hair, so you have to say rambut pendek. So just now your friend, uh, she or he, they have a rambut panjang or pendek. Okay, put in your essay. Okay, just now, how about their hair? Is it straight or curly? If their hair is straight, so you should say lurus. Lurus. But if their hair is curly, so you, sh you should say keriting. Reading, okay, and also if you if you don't want to share about their long or short hair, and you want to mention about their color of hair, maybe you can say rambut dia hitam. That means is uh, she have a black hair, okay, black hair. And then if they have a brown hair, you should say perang. With e perpet eh perang, but if you read with it aling perang, so the meaning is difference. The meaning is wars, war. You know war, okay? If you say put perang, is a color brown. If you say perang, is a war, okay? So please remember about the vocabulary. So let's continue. How to describe about their eyes? How to describe about their eyes? Okay, so if your friend have a round eyes or circle eyes, you have to mention they have mata bulat. Mata bulat. That means round eyes. Okay, some of you, okay, most of a Chinese student, almost you lah from a Chinese student, you have a eyes, a queenie eyes, mata sepet. Okay, squinny eyes or, or just a small eyes. Okay, mata sepet. Okay. All right. But uh, most of students come from uh, Indians, uh, Bangladesh. All right. So actually they have a big eyes. Okay. Uh, maybe you have a friend. Uh, she or he have a big eyes. Sometimes I, al I also have a big eyes. You can look at my eyes is small, right? But 
if I look at your carry marks, uh, below than 65, automatic my eyes is looking weak eyes. Uh, so please careful, yeah. Please make sure your carry mark is more than 65 and above to, to pass in my subject. All right, so now we are talking about the color of eyes. Uh, look at the color of eyes, okay? So I just mentioned about three color only because most of people, they have so many color because they have put uh, the lens in their eyes, right? So I just put a three color. I just teach you about the three colors. First, mata biru, I mean it's blue eyes. Mata hitam is black eyes. Mata perang is... What color of perang? Brown. Brown eyes. So, do you have a brown, black or blue eyes? What color of you? Brown. Brown. Come on. Almost brown. <laughs> Hitam. Hitam. Oh, same like me lah. Okay. Ah, so, I have also a black color. Alright, so settle about that. So I prepared to you a simple sentence how to mention about hair and eyes color. Okay, so may I have a uh, way chuyang? Chuyang, chuyang, are you there, chuyang? Uh, chuyang? Yeah, okay. okay. Yeah, try yeah. to read, try to read the both uh the all of sentence in there. Uh Ram uh, Alia Rambut. Rambu Alia Panjang. Okay, what do you mean? Uh, first, uh, like his uh, curve is here's cur curve. No, what, what the meaning of Panjang? Panjang is what? A br bronze? No. A color. The first one, the first sentence, panjang is what? Um, or or long, long, hair. long hair. Oh, okay. Long hair, Chuyang. Alia's okay. hair is long. Okay, Alia's hair is long. Panjang is long. Okay, the second sentence, read. Uh, Rambu Alia Kariting. Okay. Uh, the, 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 here's cur curve, curve yes, hair. Not curve, curly. Okay. Oh, curly. Okay. Right, so the last one. Rambu alia para. Not perang. Perang is war. Perang. Perang. Oh, para. Okay. Uh, brown, bronze, bronze here. Right? Yes, Alia has brown hair. Okay, oh. thank you, Chingyang. Continue. Uh, uh, Deng Xingbing? Deng Xingbing or Deng Xingbing? What pronounce your name? Xingbing. Xingbing? Okay, how to pronounce your name? Deng or Deng? Uh, Deng. Okay, Deng, Deng. Deng Xingbing. Okay, Deng Xingbing, yes. read both of sentence with the meaning. Where are you? Uh, go is all go is everywhere. <laughs> uh, yes, because uh, no, um, I have a meeting. <laughs> oh my God. Yes. Boss, Sorry. please drop their salary, Ross. Because they're not competent uh, with the meeting. But both, both, both in the next, next room. <laughs> Okay, go to it. Oh, okay. Madame Narob, uh, black. All right. Um, mean. Uh, Madame, Madame Narob, Peru. Okay. So what? What do you mean in both of the sentence? Uh, it means uh, 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 his eyes. His eyes is no, no, no. Uh, Please don't help Ximbing. Let you find the answer with your own. <laughs> what is uh, it? Okay. Uh, I got it means, but I can't explain. 
Yeah lah, because you focus on your meeting and you on the class. You did not focus about the classes. No, I, 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 I think I left in my class because my boss uh, speak so boring. So I, I, I enjoy and this class. <laughs> boss, uh, he say your meeting is boring, boss. <laughs> yeah. Yes, because so boring. They just talk uh, some, uh, whatever. So boring. Oh, you talk with your boss, yeah? I I have a record, so I have to I have to send this record to your boss. Ah. So so I I will uh study study this class. Uh, uh, okay curtain. okay. All right. So give me what the meaning. Mata naurah bulat. What is it? Uh, wait a minute. Hmm. Faster, Xing Bing. Yeah. Bulat, bulat. What do you mean of bulat? It means this. Uh, what is it? What is it? It means, uh, it's I, mean, I it's mean, it's mean. It's mean. It's, it's, it's mean. Sepuluh kali is mean, is mean. What is it? I don't ah. know how to express it. Okay, Sorry. okay. Okay, Xingbing, I give you, okay, I give you a few minutes. Try to find what the meaning mata naurah bulat and also mata naurah biru. I will ask you after at the end of the lesson. Okay? Okay. Ah, Please, yeah, find the answer. If okay, not, thank you. yeah, if not, yeah. Okay, class, we waiting for the meeting about Martin Aura Bulat and Martin Aura Biru from King Bing. Okay, so let's continue about the slide, slide number 11. So now I want to teach you how to tell us about the face shape and the skin color. Okay, so if you want to mention about they have a round face, so you should mention about Muka Bulat. Muka Bulat, that means they have a a circle face or round face, but uh, if they have an oval face, so you should say muka bujur, muka bujur. And please look at other. Sometimes they have a face is like a square. Okay, so we call it is segi empat. Segi empat is square. So now we have a three pattern of face. The first one is round or bulat. The second one is oval or bujor. And the third one is square. Segi empat. Okay? Please remember about the face shape. So now we are talking about the skin color. There are just two type of skin color. The first one, gelap. is like ravi, dark color. And cerah. That means it's bright color. So your friend, they have a dark color or bright color, okay? So, and the last things about their nose shape, okay? The nose shape, we just have two types. The first one is manchung, manchung. And the second one is peset. So manchung, we call it as a pointed nose. And peset, we call it, uh, and peset is a narrow nose. Right? Okay, so I prepared to you also the simple sentence about the face and about the nose. So, may I have uh, Huang Yuming? Yuming, where are you? Yes, yes, doctor. I'm okay, here. please read the whole of sentence with the meaning. Uh, Le haya bula. Mean? Means her face is long. Face for who? Huh? Okay, Ria face. Face, face, is... face for who? Yeah, face for who? Face for the uh, ladies called Le haya. <laughs> right? Yes, ladies' name is Ria. Okay. Oh, Leia. Okay, uh, okay. Leia. Leia Bulat. Okay, very good. The second? Uh, call it Leia Chiala. 
Chela. Yeah, Chela mean? Ah, uh, Chela. Uh, means the lady names uh, her yard, her skin is, is, is what? <laughs> white? I told you bright, lah, not white. Bright color. Oh, bright color. Okay, the last one. Means the, oh, the one, uh, Hindu, Puan, Mila, Mila, Macham. Macham, Manchum. Machum, Machum. You mean? Meaning, 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 I don't know. Hmm? I just teach you a few seconds, the last. Oh my God, so sad lah. What do you mean of manchum? They just have two types of manchum. The first one is pointed and the second one is narrow nose. So just now it's pointed or narrow nose? Manchum is, is it uh, the note? Hmm? Narrow nose. Are you sure narrow nose, manchum? Long nose. Long nose like Pinocchio? High nose. High nose? No. High nose is the arrogant people. What is it? Like a top cruise nose. What I call you before this? Where are you guys? I teach you from. Is, is pointed? Yes, pointed is the best answer. Okay. So, Puan Mira nose is pointed. Okay. Okay. Then pointed the meaning and... is that Mira's nose is pointed. You just say Mira nose or Madam Mira? Oh, Madam Mira point. Madam Mira nose is pointed. Okay, okay very good, Yuli. Okay, you did it. Okay. All right, Best so class, uh, we go to the how to mention about the physical shape. Actually, okay, I, I give you a few minutes to find the words, okay, to find the meaning for each word. But just now, we have to, uh, a few things have to discuss about your assignment and also about your test one. So the time is uh, very jealous with me. So I just give you about the meaning. So I hope please remember about the vocabulary for today. Huh? Okay, look at tinggi. Tinggi, the meaning is just put down. Put down the meaning, eh? put down the meaning in your lecture notes. Okay. Tinggi. Wait, eh? where's my notes? Okay, tinggi, the meaning is tall, like a ravi. Rendah, rendah is short, okay? Tinggi, rendah is short. Okay, sometimes if you try to open this dictionary, you will be found the meaning of tinggi is, uh, uh, what we call it? Uh, high, okay? High, and rendah, the meaning is low. Actually, if now we want to describe about the people. So the best answer is uh, tall and short, not height and low. Because height and low is suitable for building okay? or maybe blood pressure. Okay. All right. So panjang is uh, long. Pendek is short. Gemo is fat. Tini is kurus. Besar is big, small is kecil. All right, got it? Okay, so I have someone try to repeat again. Yuhan, Chen Yuhan. Chen Yuhan. Are you there? Yes, madam. Okay. Chen Yuhan. Tell me Are what I'm meaning. Uh, yes. Okay, please. Tell me what I'm meaning. Tinggi is 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 tall. Mm -hmm. Rinda is short. Mm -hmm. Panjang is long. Pende is short. Jemo is fat. Kurus is uh, skinny or slim. Thin. Skinny. 
Bursa is big. Kersil is uh, small. Okay, actually not kersil. Eh? Kerchil. Kerchil. Okay, actually not kersil. Eh? Okay, so class, let's we continue uh, with the last slide. So now we are talking about the uh, characteristic. Okay, characteristic. So before that, before that, I asking uh, Ching uh, Deng, Deng, Deng Ching Bing, did you find the answer? Deng Ching Bing, Deng, Ching Bing, uh, Ching yes. Bing. Did you find the answer? What yes. is it? Yes. Uh, flat okay. is flat is uh, large. Pardon? Uh, large. Okay. It means round. Round. Okay. La rounds. Not large. Yes. Eh. Nara eyes is round. The second one. Uh, second one is. Uh, I hear. You. I hear you type something. You try to you Google, try to use a Google Meet. Second one, yes. yes. The second one is uh, Nora Eyes is blue. Okay, very good. Terima kasih. So settle hutang, eh? Then, okay. So class, let yes. me begin to the last uh last part about characteristic. Okay, I read the meaning for each sentence for each word. So please put down in your lecture notes. Berani is brave. So opposite of berani is penakut. The meaning of penakut is coward or timid. Okay, coward or timid. All right. So ceria is cheerful. Opposite of ceria is pemarah. Pemarah is grumpy. Okay. So, mesra is friendly. Opposite of mesra is sombong. So, sombong is arrogant. Baik is good. Opposite of baik is jahat. Jahat is bad or evil. Tampan is handsome. Cante is beautiful. That's why I told you tampal for men. Uh, beautiful for for a woman. Okay, so opposite of tampan and handsome is hodo. So hodo is ugly. All right. So rajin is hardworking. Opposite of hardworking is lazy. Pemalas. Okay. Fine. Got it. Come class. Okay. Chang Wen Rui, Chang Wen Rui, Wen Rui, Chang Wen Rui. Hello, hello, Okay, please read again uh, uh, for each words with the meaning. Uh, oh. Okay. Oh, 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 what's that? Let's, let's try to read again for each words. With the meaning, what the meaning of berani? Uh, berani is a bold. Brave. Uh, Saraya. Okay, opposite, opposite of brave is what? The blue color. Bold. Ah, bold. Penakut uh. is coward, coward or timid. Okay. Coward. Coward, yes. Okay, how about Cheria? What the meaning of Cheria? Cheria is a cheerful. Opposite of Cheria? Uh, yeah, po positive, yeah. Yes, opposite, opposite of Cheria. What is it? Uh, Pemara. Yes, what is the meaning of pemara? Uh, uh, upset. Upset? No, it's not upset. I tell you the other uh, the meaning, you tell me the other meaning. What is the meaning of pemara? Uh, 
offset of uh, cheerful. No. no, Pemara is grumpy lah when do ini. You make me angry Kuno. lah. Okay. Pemara is grumpy. 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 Okay, so A Bang Di. Okay, thank you. Bang Di, can you continue? Uh, Masura. Ah. Uh, it means uh, uh, friendly. Friendly. Opposite of friendly? Uh, friendly. Yeah. And uh, sombong. Sombong. What do you mean of sombong? Uh, I think it's me uh, 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 not friendly. <laughs> <laughs> no, I tell you the answer. No. Uh, uh, sorry. Uh, I, I for, for, forgot it. <laughs> oh, guys, what happened with you today? Eh? Sombong is grumpy. Gram eh, no, 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 no. Sombong is arrogant. Okay, arrogant. Ah, okay, one more. <laughs> How about uh, bite? What the meaning of bite? Bite is good. Good. A positive of good? Yes, po po positive. Good. Uh, ja ja Not ja good. Hat. Huh? Not good? No, no, just, just joke. Okay, now good is jahat. What the meaning of jahat? Jahat is bad or worse. Okay, bats are uh, bad or evil. All right, thank you. Okay, continue. Uh, Deng Xingbing. Deng Xingbing. Okay. okay, what are meaning of tampan or chante and hodo? Uh, it means handsome. Handsome. Chante? Yeah. It's beautiful. Is it my beautiful? <laughs> <laughs> okay, how about Hodo? Hodo means ugly. Ugly. All right. Thank you. Yeah. Terima kasih. Man Man, okay, the last you. one. Man Man? Uh, hi. hi, teacher. Yes. Re yes. Regent, hardworking. Pemalas? Uh, pemalas, lazy. Okay, very good. Terima kasih. Okay. So, guys, that's all for today. Alright. So, this is our uh, lesson for part three where you know how to describe about your friend, how not to tell us about your uh, family. Okay. So, class, I want to share with you also about um, your assignment. Okay. I will put... The material about the assignment in the put uh, in the WhatsApp groups. Wait here. Yeah. Where is it? The assignment. Mm. Okay, I just to explain yeah what you have to do, what you're going to do about the assignment. Okay. This is the assignment number one. I have 10% marks. Okay. So what you have to do, you have to find your members. So, but but uh, the good uh, the best news is we have a uh, fifteen participant. The only group that have three people. Okay, the only one groups, the only one group that have three people. Okay, for others just two papers only, because you have fifteen uh, members. So there's one group that have three people, and the others they have a uh, two people. So what you have to do, choose the only one situation. What the situation is, uh, you have to interview your friends about uh, herself, about her family, or about her best friend. Okay? So, you have to choose which one topic you like it, and then you have to record the interview session with your partner. The duration about two or three minutes only. All right? So, in your session must be used the vocabulary what I given to you in the class. For example, if you want to interview your friends, uh, so you have to ask it about name, about the country, about the age, about the faculty, resident, and also hobby. Okay, this is what we uh, I teach you in the class only. Please don't ask it about their ambition, 
about their favorite food. No, I didn't teach you anymore. So don't use the vocab is. You have to apply vocabs what we will learn in the class only. All right. Or if you want to use the topic number two about their family, maybe you can ask kings about your partner, about uh, father's mother's name, how many siblings does uh, she have, how about their sister name, brother's name, and younger sister name. That's all. Okay. And also same like their about their family, about their their friends, right? So please use the same vocabs what we will learn in the class only. Right. Okay, so the number four, uh, this interview, interview session must be recorded. It's up to you. You want to use, uh, uh, you want to use the, uh, with the handphone application or you want to use a Google Meet or a Zoom meeting. So you have to record the session and put also the subtitle. Okay, subtitle must be done in Bahasa Melayu because of some time, when you try to talking in Malay language, sometimes your pronunciation is not clear. And then they have a big problem to me, want to describe how many marks I have given to you. Okay, so if, if your pronunciation is not clear, I, I can refer about your subtitle. So please put your sub subtitle, this is a mandatory. Okay, what happened if you complete your, your video without subtitle? Okay, I have to deduct two marks from your, uh, from 10%. Actually, just have 8% marks only. All right. So, after the recording settle, so please upload the video in YouTube account. Okay. If you don't have YouTube account, please use uh, your friend's account, YouTube uh, account, your daughter, your, daughter your, your sister or your brother. I don't care uh, who is YouTube account, you want to use it, okay? But the most important, I just need the links, okay? Put your links in this form, okay? Put your link in this form here, all right? And then you have to submit this form only. No need to submit your video in uh, Putra Blast. Just put the link only. I will check and I will give in to you uh, marks based on your video. All right. So number six, uh, you will be assessed on based on your pronunciation, your vocabulary, your grammar and your fluency. Okay. Uh, please don't use a bombastic words like uh, what I never teach you in the class. Huh? No need to use. Okay. And the last thing, the due dates. Okay, you must to submit your video before or on weeks. Uh, on weeks X. I mean, it's just now we are in a weeks one, two, three, four, four. Okay, so you have four weeks start from now to submit this assignment. Okay, I mean, it's your date is before before. Well, let me let me check the date is. Yeah. Okay, before December 24. Yeah, the due, the due date is December 24. Okay, class, got it? Ah. So, so this is your assignment you have to do with your partner. Okay, settle about the assignment. All right, so guys, I want to tell you about your test one. Okay, your test one, we will uh, run on December 7. So next week, next week, okay, class listen eh. Next week, we have to discuss about your exercise. Exercise one, exercise two, and exercise three. Okay, so please complete your exercise. I have to call your names. So everybody, you have to share your screen because everybody can read your essay. For example, this is a uh, topic three. So you have to download the exercise topic three with ya. Okay, this is uh, exercise three. I will put the material in WhatsApp group, look at. The first question is, you have to write down a short essay about your family. 
So please write down your short essay in this column. And then next week, everybody must share your answer. You have to share your screen to make sure everybody can read your essay. And then everybody must be teachers, try to remark your friend's essay. Okay? And also complete the answer number two. Just fill in the blank with the correct answer. Okay? This uh, question I already teach you what the meaning of kool -Aid. What is it kool -Aid? What the meaning of kool -Aid? What does it mean of kool -Aid? kool -Aid if what? Class? What the meaning of kool -Aid? Skin. Skin. Yes. Okay, so runny skin is very, what is it? Is it panjang? Panjang is long. Is it cheerier? Cheerier is a cheerful. Is it biru? Because biru is a blue color. Yeah, because runny is avatar. So runny skin is blue. Uh, so it's up to you lah. You want to put uh, which one the answer. So when I call your name, so you have to share screen and then you have to show me the answer. Okay, guys. All right, so I will put uh, in the WhatsApp groups about the exercise number one, exercise number two, and also exercise number three, and also about the assignment number one, okay? Please refer, please read carefully, and then if you still any inquiries, just drop your question in WhatsApp group. I try to respond as soon as possible, okay? So, ada soalan, guys? Ada soalan? Isn't I talk alone? Ada soalan guys? I asking you any question? Okay, okay. No question, please. Okay, okay. What do you mean? Okay, okay. <laughs> ada or tiada? Tiada. Tiada. Okay. Hey, I forget lah. I for Guys, I forget lah. Who's our uh, representative class? Mia. Uh, pardon? You mean? You mean? You mean? Wang Yu Ming. Wang Yu Ming. Ah, okay. Wang Yu Ming. Okay, I, I will share with you our material. So you uh, you share with your friend, okay? Please, <laughs> you just put into the group. Uh, it's the same. Uh, you you say it to me and say to the group. <laughs> Ah, uh, is it Wang you mean you our you our representative class, right? Yes. Ah, okay. You uh you mean can you accept me? Of course. Okay, no. okay. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. After the end of the class, lah. Okay? okay. Because I want to share with you something, so you have to share with your friends about the detail, about the test, about the exercise, and so many things lah. So I want to dating with uh, you, Ming. So everybody, if you don't have a question, uh, it's okay for today. So see you again next week. And Assalamualaikum. Jumpa lagi. Bye-bye, everybody. See you. See you, Miss. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 When you want to say thank you, everybody involved. When I ask you any question, everybody quiet. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.